Liberty returned to the Vine Center for the first time in 19 days to host Greensboro College on Saturday. The Flames winners of two straight facing the pride for the first time while Greensboro was trying to break a five-game losing skid. Tomas Gielo with three of his game-high 13 points early on as Liberty would build a 8-0 lead. The dunk meter was on display in the Vine Center Saturday. Andrew Smith cleared for takeoff as he slams down one of his two dunks. Liberty goes up by 10 and the crowd gives it a 9.5. Eight minutes later, Antoine Burris tries the collapsible rim. Yep, it works. Liberty on its way to a 46-17 lead at halftime. To the second half now, Flames up 25 when Joel Vanderpol shows off his inside game with a drop step and a bucket. The fifth year senior ends the game with six points and five rebounds. Did we mention dunks? Smith again with a carbon copy of his hammer slam from the first half, this time an undisputed 10 from the judges. The Flames led from the opening tip until this Devin Pekas glide through the lane. Liberty wins it 84-47. Three and double figures for Liberty as the Flames win their third game in a row. Gielo with a game-high 13 points, while Antoine Burris and John Caleb Sanders chip in 12. And as a team, Liberty holds its fourth straight opponent under 34% shooting. Yeah, we've had a, a very intense week of practice. Um, going into this game, we knew they, they weren't the best team we are going to play all year, obviously, but we didn't want to give them any chance. We've had, you know, a few guys, Devon didn't play tonight, uh, so we knew we were missing a, a big part of our team, but coach is just real intentional on getting stops, getting out and running, and that's exactly what we did, and we, we punched him in the mouth right out of the gun. Yeah, I, I think we, uh, our concentration was good, and uh, when you concentrate and you execute and you try to do what's right, um, typically good things follow. We, we've been playing more like that um, you know, when we were in Texas and uh, Missouri, I think that that was more how we played. And uh, we carried it over to a game tonight. And it's good to see our guys uh, continue to move forward. I thought we improved. 